So here is the wood defects detection prototype that we have developed. And down here we have a smartphone which simulates a conveyor belt sending defective wood images into the system. Uh, the wood defect prototype over here uh, has a camera which captures images and sends it to the Raspberry Pi above uh, which processes the images and uh, outputs the locations and the types of defects on each of the piece of wood. So uh, the outputs of the camera together with the inspection results are shown in real time on the monitor screen here which is connected to the Raspberry Pi. So you can have a look at the outputs of the inspection results on the monitor screen. If, for example, that external lighting factors uh, such as shadow and external lighting sources can affect the accuracy of the system, uh, we can install an enclosure like this box, black box over here to cover the entire prototype so that uh, it will guard off from external lighting sources and shadows uh, which can affect the accuracy of the system. So when we install this, it can uh, improve the accuracy and stability of the system. As you can see uh, in the screen over here. Uh, so now let's see the hardware components of the wood defect detection prototype. Firstly, we have a handle over here so that we are able to easily uh, carry the, the prototype. Uh, besides that, we have a smartphone down here which shows a video uh, that simulates a conveyor belt sending defective wood images into the system. Okay, and uh, down there, there is a camera which captures these images and sends these images via this FFC cable to the Raspberry Pi up here. Uh, the Raspberry Pi is connected to a power source and an HDMI cable which sends the, the captured images and the inspection results to the monitor screen which shows it in real time. And finally, we have a shutdown button over here uh, where we click it and we press it and it will shut down the system. Yep. That's all. Thank you.